His old nationalist foe, Maurice de Plessy, was found in storage. Cast in bronze, he was a subject of idle curiosity. Trudeau refused to distinguish between the old authoritarian's nationalism and the new populist brand, which was very much alive. And I'd like to say we've got no lesson on that score to take from the McConnells, from anyone that has been dominating Quebec like a bunch of Rhodesians. The white group. If we had colors here, you'd feel it. And that is something we will not stand anymore. This paternalistic wasp. And it is that, typically. Wasp arrogance of the ones that have been leading our governments. And through the slush funds that they contribute to. Leading both of our hack parties. By the nose for too long. No, we, so, don't, we don't want to every, lose you. I don't want to lose you either. All right, why not? But we have to exchange, like, really be free, both you and me. Yeah. And every people in the, in the world just want that. But you're looking... Pauline Julien, Quebec singer and separatist, and you, interviewed by Patrick Watson. I'm just asking you we now... We have just a few years to save ourselves. Is there an answer from where you sit to, well, to people like Pauline Julien who talked to us earlier today and who is an extremely eloquent propounder of this statement of personal need to exist as a, as a cultural entity? Well, it's like someone who would say, you know, psychologically, I have to stay within the British Empire. This is a psychological need to make sure the sun rises and sets on parts of me. How do you argue with a person? No, like but that's that? an enormously contemptuous thing to say about people who, who feel profoundly that they have been pulling themselves up from. And you know all about well, that. Well, some Colonel Blimps felt very profoundly about the British Empire. All I can say is that we're living in a different world now. But our Ms. Julien or Colonel Blimp are living in, you know, the early 19th century. But uh, are you equating the passion of a person like Ms. Julien or the ambitions of a man like Levesque with the instinct to hold on to a fading power that, per, that Colonel Blimp stands for? If people, as they, many of this type of person says, you know, I can't argue with you. You talk economics, you talk sociology, you talk politics, you talk history. This may sound good, but it's a question of dignity. It's a question of feeling. What do you say? Go and feel your own way, you know. Uh, I'll feel mine. This was all very well for Pierre Elliott Trudeau, but the English-speaking residents of his home riding of the town of Mount Royal had a lot of houses for sale. Many of them weren't even waiting for the spring election. For the first time in Quebec, there was a viable separatist party with a leader who was once a minister of the crown. What chance do you have of becoming premier of Quebec in the next election? If we get less than 10, 10 or 12 ridings, it's rather catastrophic. <laughs> He got only seven seats. He lost his own. But the PQ got 23% of the vote, and Levesque was a hero. Yeah!